when you have an individual, like a kind of one-to-one -one session, it's, it's very much more like you get the exact feedback you need. It's very like directed. It's like this, this, this. It's not just be more on time. It's, it's just very much, they look at your e-chart, there's like feedback, feedback. You kind of have there someone to, to like ask, when should I do this? How should I do these preps? And they kind of just help you on everything. It's like a, like almost a HQ. If you, if you couldn't, if you didn't have that, then you'd be kind of, oh my gosh, what am I doing? Like, how do I do this? Um, and they just kind of ground you. They say, this is the way to go. This is like how you do it. what should get you excited about working here as well because it's a unique opportunity and when you contrast it to what a tutor group means in most schools chalk and cheese well it is and with the tutoring it's it's a five-year commitment you, you meet the people when they arrive on day one and five years later they're heading out into the world and you do you realize I have tutorial pupils now who let me know of a job they're doing or that they're getting married or so it becomes a bit of a you know it's a lifelong relationship really. Our experience Francesca's experience of the tutorial system here was second to none. Doc Fernley um, was uh, Francesca's tutor they got on like a house on fire um, are still in contact and it gave her that regular weekly catch-up, albeit may have only been 15 minutes, but one-to-one -one on her own where she could just say anything. It's quite a parental role, I suppose, in that respect. And, you know, I can speak about it from the perspective of being a parent. So I'm probably a little bit mumsy towards them when they are in year nine and year 10. And I go see her in her little um, office that she has. And we sit on like her little sofa she has. And that's our time to like catch up and talk during the week. And we just talk about anything and everything, really. Like, um, if I've had a bad day, we talk about that. We talk about, we review work. But taking them on that journey and seeing them grow and seeing their interests change um, is, is incredibly rewarding. I mean, it's the same rewards that you get out of watching your own children. It starts when we very first meet a family. Um, so that could be two, three, four years before a child starts with us. Um, every time we meet with them, we get to know a little bit more about the family, we get to know a little bit more about the child. So before I came to Bryanston, the head interviewed me and asked me loads of questions about myself, about what I liked, what subjects I enjoyed, and decided that um, Mr. Sangrashka and I would be a good tutorial match. Because I remember before Bryanston, you get a letter where they tell you who your tutor is and they also match, they match on like interests and in general because they have the feeling like they get to know you, familiarisation day and all the times so you visit Bryanson before you actually come. That will all come to a head in a conversation that each child has with either the head or one of our admissions tutors um, and that is specifically at that point in finding out even more information um, to enable us to match them with a tutor and um, they asked you a few questions on what you like doing and I went into some, some detail about physics and astrophysics and how I really find the subject fascinating. Um, and my tutor is Dr. Carney, uh, who's a physics teacher and he's really fascinating. He know he's, blimey, he's really smart. We can provide a support, see them through difficult times, be a, a, somebody constant, somebody to just come and talk to, and it doesn't have to be that weekly meeting. You're there any time for them to come and just talk through whatever it is that's bothering them. Yes, they've got the, the housemaster and the chaplain, whoever else, but you are that, that central figure. Um, and I think they come to trust you. What makes a good tutor, I, I, I think it's actually really simple. Um, just be really uh, full of praise for th stuff that they've achieved. Um, and encourage them when they're down as well. You know, it's not just when they're winning, but it's also when things aren't going well. Her tutor absolutely clicks with her, brings out the best in her, and has her opening up completely, not just about um, how she's getting on in her lessons, but how she's getting on in life. That is their time as well. It's not your time, it's their time. And they, hopefully come into the room with the expectation that in that 
20 minutes, half an hour, 45 minutes, however long you're there for, that you are actually, you're theirs, they are your focus. Because by, by listening, you can act then in accordance with what they need you to do. It's, it's, it's very holistic. Um, it, it, it's, it's completely comprehensive. And, and we've certainly had the, the, the sense that, that Stephen is on Tom's side. Um, not, not in a kind of indulgent way, He's able to push Tom in the right direction, and that's what we've seen. And given that Tom is here 12, 13, 14 hours a day, to have someone who knows more clearly than we do how he's spending his time, and whether that is being productive, and what proportion of that is downtime, which of course is necessary in that length of time, is helpful. And I think that's a, that's a really important part of Bryanston. And the one-to-one -one tutorials or, one -to or small lessons, I think, is so helpful with that. Because not all children learn at the same pace. We see that in here, even in the work that we do in the cafe. We see the behaviour and the, the way the children are. We see it, they're so different. And I think when you've got in, individual attention, I think that really helps. That's where the tutoring system here does differ. That, you know, you, you are theirs, that, that you are their ambassador, you are their protector, you are, you know, you're there for them, them only. And I think that's, that's really unique. It does what it says it's going to do. And I don't think that you believe it when you first hear it, but it does do 